and these are this is two different ways to do hot compresses mm -hmm. like that, uh, uh, to start with how we uh, recommend the patient this left page she shows them the what supplement they should use and what they should mm -hmm. do humidifier and the hot compressors and decrease caffeine use and all of that. Mm -hmm. So that's what we give them and they come back between like three to four weeks. Then we see what else needs to be done. And if mm -hmm. they need if any inflammation, we give them uh, anti-inflammatory drops also. And then finally, patients who don't uh, get full uh, benefit from these treatments, all these treatments, mm -hmm. all, all these treatments are exhausted. Then we Put them. Uh, can you bring her? Uh, the, uh, no, can we bring her from the free? We have a, a membrane called amniotic membrane. Mm -hmm. This is uh, derived from uh, placenta of healthy moms, and that tissue has very strong healing power. Mm -hmm. What happens is with the dry eyes, with the chronic dry eyes, um, the corneal nerves get degenerated. Mm -hmm. Those are important for keeping our cornea healthy. And when we put this membrane on the cornea, we put a contact lens over that. That's one way to do it. There's another kind of a membrane, which is even very effective. And it's a frozen. We keep it as frozen. We call it Prokera. And that we, it's kind of like a large contact lens. We put on the patient's eye and uh, we either tape or we don't tape. And then within five to seven days, this gets absorbed on the patient's cornea. Mm -hmm. And the patient heals much better. So patient's cornea is healed, and then the patient's uh, glands are open. So patient's dry eyes should be totally, um, and much, much better. We say, don't say cured, but it'd be much, much better, okay? Yes, totally that cold. would be like great for the patient too. You know, yeah. it would be a problem they're able to solve. Yeah, those are most advanced, those two most advanced treatments and most effective. Mm -hmm. you know, yes, these ones right here. Yeah. If somebody has a cornea ulcer, we used to um, use like fortified um, eye drops and all that. It was uh, hard to do, but these days with the, um, um, uh, this uh, membrane, it's mm -hmm. uh, okay, they treated very, very well. And corneal is the most effectively treated. 